All right, well, let's get started. First step, let's see, I'm gonna find some uh, art kit online. Just pull something from here. Oh, I forgot to get a timer, hang on. There we go. So, I'm gonna get an art kit here. Field of green, that, no. I don't want that guy. Generic RPG pack, nah. This, this looks nice. Mm -hmm. Maybe I should use that. Uh, yeah, I like that. So let's uh, grab this, download. No thanks. I wanna start by making, let's I guess we'll make the world and then um, I wanna make it character. So let's, here we go. All right, so that's the jump. That looks like the run. Okay, so if I say there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two vertical frames, eight horizontal frames. Nice, okay, cool. So now I can add the animator to it and let's create a walk animation. What time am I at? 50 minutes, okay, wow. See there, 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 there. Nice, okay. And then we add in an idle. And I could use one and two. And then put you at point two. Loop. Oh, that's kind of down. Point eight. That's fine. Yeah. For the jump, let's yeah, let's just use that. That's good. And subs project uh, input here. Let's see. Move right. Move left and jump, move right, key D, left, A, jump, space, okay. And then, uh, what do you add? Script, less gravity, this will be so, if I hold down the jump button, we can jump higher. So I'll give a nice uh, drag and nice acceleration, physics-y movement, uh, super meat boy style or whatever. So basically if we leave the ground but we press jump like a split second later we can still jump and if we press jump an instant before touching the ground we want to jump the moment we hit the ground. I think that's all the code for that so I just have to mess around with it and get it to be right. So let's see, I add in a static body, add in a sprite to it, and let's just toss this on. And then let's add the player, player to here and also need to add a camera. So I can move, I can't jump, or, oh right, because I need to set the jump force to be negative. Uh, where's the jump, here it is. There we go. Still not working. Is that because that needs to be a hub, right? There we go. Y is greater than, I'm so used to dealing with 3D. I forget, you gotta use pixels with this. Nice, oh that looks cool. Falls really slow though. Um, ah, there we go. That's what I was looking for. And if I hold the jump button, I definitely go higher. Still doing way too high though. Yeah. So you can short hop and you can hold it and jump even higher. Nice. Sweet. Okay. So that's that done. Well, let's see. How much time do I have? 26 minutes. Okay. Let's see what I can get done. 26 minutes. There we go. Made the character, now we need to make a world. So let's see, a tile map. What do I want to use here? What would be the quickest thing to use? Let's grab you. And literally just draw this on. Nice. Oh crap, that's way too fast. Um, oh, that's so fast. Hmm. Yeah, that could be fun. As long as I don't have any holes in the level. It's good enough for now. We'll just leave it. Yeah, so you see I'm able to jump a little bit off the edge there. It's pretty exaggerated. Now if I hit it right in the midair, right before I land, I'll still jump the moment I hit the ground. Hmm, a wall jump would be nice, but I don't have time for that. So, let's see, next step. I want to make a turret thing that shoots at you and you have to dodge it. So add in a sprite maybe. And it just, it's gonna rotate at you and shoot bullets. What's in here that I could use? There is, oh, there's this, oh, that's perfect. Do they have any bullets? Would be an easy bullet to see. I wanna use this and this. 
down. Just snap that there. Drop this. Bam. There we go. Let's see. There we go. Okay, so it's pointing at us and it's firing. Cool. So now I need to make the actual bullets. So let's see what I'll make for bullets. Is there a bullet on here? Something cool I could use. I guess I'll just use this. This is to the point. Uh, okay, cool. It works perfectly. They move way too slow, um, but I can fix that. Cool. Okay. So, what's the time? What do I have time to do right now? 10 minutes. So, I could make a restart. Let's do that. Uh, restart. And we can have this. You died. Press R to restart. Restart message dot show. All right, I want to make so you can't move, but I still want gravity to be applied. Nice. Okay. And then the last thing I want to do is add in a particles. Let's change that to like some certain amount. <laughs> okay, that'll be blood. There we go. All right, nice. So how much time do I have? Let's see. It's two minutes and 50 seconds. Okay. So last, finally, the last one is, what was the last one? Oh yeah, level design. That's right. Duh. Okay, so let's tile map and let's put a victory message in somewhere. Label uh, you win or something. You win. So now I want to make a really long level that. Oh, and I need uh, instructions also. Uh, AD to move, space to jump. And uh, let's put the player here. And let's just literally drop stuff. And let's just freaking throw stuff. So I'm running out of time. Window, let's shake this to full screen. And then finally, I just want to hide the cursor. Uh, input dot mouse mode hidden. Five seconds. Oh, it's not hidden, what the hell? All right, I ran out of time. Let's just uh, change the uh, mouse mode to hidden. Pretty good though. Nice. So here's the shitty game I made in one hour. I don't think I actually made any of those reachable. Wow. <laughs> okay, I think I'm gonna add a bit to it. Yeah, this isn't actually playable. Okay, so after the fact, Okay, so the hour is officially up, but this level sucks, so I'm gonna I'm gonna add stuff to it. Um, let's see. Let's make see so you have to like jump up here or something. Uh, maybe you have to like go there. And you have to like go there, and then you have to like jump. I don't remember how high I can jump, so let's make so you can go up there. And then you have to like track your way up here, and then there will be like a turret up here. Let's see what that plays like. Well, I got a functional game in the time set. It's not like fun or anything, but it's almost fun. I feel like it's just the level design that's holding it back right now. Definitely need to be able to jump higher. It's like all these tweaks and stuff that take so long. I can hold the jump, that's right. Yeah, you can jump a lot higher if you hold it. I forgot. And then you make the bullets move faster because they're just too slow. Oh, okay. Oh, if you touch the bullet but it doesn't collide with you, then it'll it won't count as a collision. So I have to have player checks too. Oh well, good enough for the jam. All right, well now let's just build stuff around here, I guess. Yeah, first time trying this, it's kind of an idea I've been toying with a while, just doing like little one-hour jams, show off what you can do, kind of a almost speed run thing. So yeah, if you guys like it, I'll, I'll do some more. And the more I do, crap, the better I'll get at it. Oh, it'd be nice to have checkpoints. Maybe in the two hour jam. All right, I have to beat my own game. Like, that's required. Oops. Just have to get to there. I 
I feel like I'm getting worse the more I do this. Yeah, I win. Okay. Woo! Yeah, eight hours to beat the final game, I know, right? All right. Well, I'll uh, put the code for this on GitHub, I guess. And then I'll make a video about it. And yeah, thanks for joining me. This is the final product after... So how much time did I spend after... What should I make in the next one? Anyone have suggestions?